Welcome to the Lotus Goddess Divine Love. Hi everyone, how's everyone doing today? Hope you're doing well and staying safe. Welcome back everyone. Welcome if you're new to my channel. I do Divine Mask and Divine Feminine Twin Flame Journey Charm Readings. And let's begin and just keep in mind that this is a general reading. Let's see what message comes through. There's a divine masculine who has a family or family members that live at a distance, but they still have a lot of say in divine masculine's life. There may have been some interference between divine masculine and divine feminine from these family members, even if they're not living in the same area. But I see here is some sort of, um, they're still like that. Of course, the connection is there because that's their family, but because they're at a distance they feel like this need to um intervene in a in a different and a more um it feels like they they interfere in it more often in a different type of way um they may come across as if like i'm i can't do anything from here or um they may have said something along the lines to divine mask and like something like um we're far away, you know, we don't see what's happening over there. or It's your decision. Make it sound like as if, you know, we're at a distance. We don't have any say. It's not really, um, we're not involved in any, any way. But what I'm seeing here is that they are involved. They are um, part of whatever is happening or whatever took place between uh, Divine Mask and Divine Feminine. I see interference here, um, even if they're at a distance. So it's like, it doesn't matter if they're like, you know, across the country or, you know, across the world in a different country. It, it they, they are still there. Like I see that their presence are still there. Uh, this Divine Masculine, it, I see them as somebody who, um, listens to these family members and yes they were they were like the third wheel like they were in the middle of your relationship some cases uh divine mask and divine feminine um may be married so i see here there's a strong bond like a marriage um kind of commitment here uh the karmic uh situation in this reading i see here the karmic coming as uh, a family member so whoever for whoever this resonates for the family member or or whoever this family um this family dynamic is they are the karmic in this in this um reading so it's not going to resonate for all but i see here that the karmic person is a family member Another thing I see here is that this divine masculine and this karmic person, this karmic person was the reason why this masculine had to start over again. I see a different cycle, some something different, going in a different direction, and a new type of living, and this was because of a karmic um, influence. So there was two, it's like kind of like a fork in a road. There were what I see here is that one side is divine feminine and the other side is this um, different way of living, a different um, path. Not necessarily a different person, but I see here like if they don't move towards divine feminine, there's another path here. And I see here that this karmic person um, has a lot, a lot of, um, th they have a lot of, not say, but... Um, the influence is there. Um, they could be trying to, from a distance, could be trying to persuade or or trying to give an idea or trying to distract this divine masculine from um, being with their counterpart. I see here that showing them another um, another way of living, a different lifestyle, 
it's like, wow, you could have this, you know, if you, if you do this, this is the kind of life you would have, you know, so-and-so is also pursuing this. It could be like a career or a place of living or the, the type of living. So I see here, some of them may be saying to Divine Masculine, stay in your a single season, stay in, um, be single, that kind of thing. It's like, you don't need to settle down. You don't need, um, someone you know by your side you're you're strong enough on your own so i see here that that influence kind of an influence is there when it comes to certain topics Will this Divine Masculine take a stand for themselves? Um, I don't see it at this point. This Divine Masculine, it's like they they kind of see their options and they're just thinking about what how it would play out. What would their life look like in a year or two? It's like, what does my life look like down the road? So if I do kind of listen to the advice of this family member or this dynamic, whoever they may be, uh, this to my masculine is like, if I listen to this person, what they have to say, and I follow through with, with kind of like their plan, then maybe this is what's going to happen, or this is how it's going to play out. And they see it as an opportunity. They see the other, the other direction as an opportunity that, yeah, maybe there is a possibility to have a different type of life, a different, um, a different way of living. And maybe it will work out. And I do see that if they take this other path, right? Not divine feminine, but this other path, that yes, certain things will work out. But it's kind of like um, camouflage. It's kind of what I'm getting is that the first steps of it looks really good. It looks like, yes, this is working out. Yes, they were right. Yes, I'm getting this opportunity. Yes, I'm getting this kind of um, success or um, I'm, I'm obtaining more uh, for example, like material or wealth or something like that. And this Divine Masculine will be caught up in that kind of like illusion that this is the path that I took. And look, it's working out for me. Yes, in the beginning, it will appear that way. I don't feel right away because there is some work involved here on Divine Masculine's part. But once things start, you know, moving along, they're going to feel like I made the right decision. But I see here that um, things will not always be as um, as this divine masculine imagines it to be. So it's like, say, if this divine masculine they start to excel, like, and they they level up, right? But that is not going to last forever. There is going to be times where something might suddenly happen, which will transform their life or take them on a different path or a different direction because I see here there's going to be a sudden transformation that will come out of something that looks or appears as good. So this masculine will be like, yeah, I'm going with the flow. Things are working out. I'm meeting new people. This is a good decision that I made. So if they do take the uh, take this decision of listening to these family members, like let me see what's out there for me. And I see here that... There's going to be a sudden uh, shock or or turn of events. Like there's something here that it's going to come out of nowhere. That where where this masculine feels that this plan is foolproof, it's not going to be that way. There's going to be a sudden change, unexpected change that's going to be out of divine masculine's hands. Where they doesn't matter which direction they turn to, which direction they look. It's like, I can't get myself out of this situation or this mess or whatever takes place. It's like they try to look for some kind of, um, you know, quick fix, like something to fix this up, something to help me get out of this situation, but it's not going to, to be like that. This masculine, because of the decision of pulling away from Divine Feminine and taking this other uh, root when things start to look good they're like oh yeah this is this is for me but when there's that sudden change that that event that takes place where it changes everything it's going to be a little bit difficult for the stomach mask to get out of that because they need to experience that it's, there's something about experience of fall so there's what i'm what i'm hearing is something about um they they need to be humble. 
this is a chance or this is an opportunity for this divine masculine to transform themselves internally. And it's like they will not learn to value certain things in their life, to know what's important in their life, to humble themselves unless they take that fall. So this basically has to play out as it is. I don't see this Divine Masculine choosing Divine Feminine here. I see them looking towards that, oh, this is, this is, um, this is a good idea. You know, the family said that maybe I should pursue this or think about this. And they're going to be more, um, lured or uh, attracted to that image of this other opportunity, this other chance or this different direction where they're going to be pulled in that, um, in that scenario or that situation where it has to play out, where that fall needs to take place so that this Divine Masculine can humble themselves. So this is the reading for today. I hope you like this reading. If you like my readings, uh, please give a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, give a comment below. And thank you all for watching. Have a beautiful day, everyone. Bye.